Hey guys, um, I was just checking my franchise, and uh, this is some of Paul's Cambridge I uh, number one, the Trinidad Chevron, uh, that I rehoused yesterday. I did uh, four of them. Um, the, the the larger one that went in no problem, um, I'm guessing it went in no problem. Well, I'm not guessing, but it was in primo. So um, <clears throat> I just checked on it and it molted. So it's it's flipped over. Uh, the molt was still quite uh quite moist so i mean had to have done it today at some point and actually i did see it this afternoon and it wasn't wasn't upside down so probably within i don't know last you know six or six hours or so but anyways um i figured i'd do a little update on it um and also i got the molt out and we're gonna i'm gonna show you for those who don't know how to uh sex a molt Here we have the molt. See here, 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 and here, the white dots. That's the book lungs. Okay, so right in between the book lungs, right here. Well, my camera's picking it up, but there's a little slit. You see that slit there? Well, the slit or a flap uh, means it's a female. If it's just a like a flat line uh, with no slit or like opening, that means it's a male. And if you see there, the two little red dots. See them there? That's the spermatokes. That's where um, the, the male makes his insertion there, and that's I guess kind of like the ovaries, which picks up the not not the ovaries, but it, it collects the sperm. So. I don't know if I got that or not. I was looking at the the, the molt. But anyways, uh, yeah, that's uh, how you sex a tarantula with a molt. And this is a female because we got the slit. Right here, you can see that slit. And there's a dot there. <clears throat> Excuse me, a dot there. And a dot there. Um, I'm going to take some pictures and I'll zoom in on it. And you'll see in their little fleshy pink things. Uh, different tarantulas. Uh, different species of tarantulas, they'll have different um, spermatokes, some are long, some are shorter than others, so there's there's different, excuse me, there's different types of spermatokes, they vary from species to species. So anyways, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video, well actually let me just see if, oh and I did measure um, the molt, and it's um, yeah, four, and, four and three quarters, close to five inches. So I'm pretty happy about that, but perfect molt. And like I said, it was uh, I was lucky that you know everything went well with that rehouse because it was so close to the molt. I'm just gonna give you guys a quick quick boo at her. Stress. Hey guys, I just moved the, the wood very gently. There she is there, looking beautiful. In her new duds. Anyways guys, uh, I'll post some pics at the end of the video. So uh, you can see the, the slit better, and also the spermatokey. Okay guys, thanks for watching and take care, have a good night, good day, wherever you're at. Bye bye.